So as you can see, I can already juggle. But there is something I've always wanted to do when it comes to juggling. It's juggling tricks, and <laughs> here are some examples of what those are. So, it seems pretty difficult, huh? Well, let's just go for it. This might take a while, but let's do it. So the first trick I decided to learn was the one up two up. In this juggling trick, you throw two balls on the sides upwards, and as those come down, you throw one ball into the middle. The challenge here is keeping these balls as straight as possible so that they don't hit each other. But needless to say, I was struggling a lot when it came to doing this trick. Oops. So after a bit of thought, I decided that to complete this challenge, I'd have to do three separate juggling tricks in a row without messing up. best here and I still suck. A few sessions later, I still had no luck with the one up two up. So I decided to shift my focus to a different skill. To my surprise, the under the leg throw didn't actually seem that hard after attempting it. And a few more attempts later, I actually landed it on the first day I decided to learn it. Oh yes, yes, you see that? Fucking did it. It's exciting, finally some success here the past few days. I just, I just felt like I was not making any progress in any of these. Whoa, that, that one was a good one. That one felt way better. Hell yeah. Can I do that again? Let's see. Ah, that was a real first land. That's some real progress. Hell yeah. Yes. Yes. So to focus on my backflip video, I actually stopped filming for two weeks. But to make sure I didn't get too rusty, I practiced some juggling in the meantime. It's been about two weeks. Since I've actually seriously practiced my juggling tricks, I'm probably worse than I was before. But let's just go into it. It's all part of the journey. Oh my god. Easy peasy. Does that count? Sure. Uh, and then lemon, lemon, lemon squeezy. Ah, that kind of counts and I'm leaning forward. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. After mastering the under the leg throw, I moved on to learn fake columns. This move is very similar to the one up two up, but the difference is one of your hands is holding on to a ball the whole time, creating a pretty cool illusion effect. However, this means that one of your hands is doing a lot of work, and mastering that part of the technique is really difficult. Although I did see a little bit of progress here and there, for the most part, the first few days of learning this skill was really tough. That was actually kind of decent. This skill along with the one up two up were the skills that were really frustrating for me. And I knew it would take a great deal of time before I mastered them. But mastering the under the leg throw was exciting and I wanted to do the same for these two other skills. While just experimenting on day 10, I found that I could easily land this new spin move after only a few attempts. Yo! <laughs> Hell yeah, like, you see that? I felt like this move had a lot of flair, so I decided to add it to the sequence of tricks I'd have to do to beat this challenge. So then I started to draw out a practice sequence, but excluding the one up two up, because it was just too hard for me to do all four. No. 
was good. Yes! <laughs> Get out of here. Okay, that's not even the full. Yeah, where are they going? My balls. Okay, anyways. Uh, <laughs> that's not the full skill, but that's three out of four. I just need the one up, two up now. My right, worst enemy. Shit. Why is today such a good day? Who made it this good? Thank you. Oh, yeah. It's all coming together. Day 11 was a disappointment. After two full hours of practicing the sequence, I didn't land it. The one up to it was simply too difficult and I would always mess that up and if I did get it, I'd mess up another part of the sequence. But the next day, I had high hopes and I tried again. Dusty, man. I'm never doing that shit again. I just gotta say, I'm so happy right now. That was just the most frustrating thing I've ever learned, honestly. <laughs> the worst part is picking up these balls, cause like, having just picked these up hundreds of times, wasn't fun. Columns is pretty cool, but it was really difficult. But the one up, two up, I hate that move so much. It was really frustrating failing over and over again when trying to tie all four skills together. But I'm really happy now that I was able to finally do it. And I'm looking forward to moving on to the next skill. Hey, I really hope you enjoyed the video and it means the absolute world to me that you stayed all the way till the end. If you enjoy this kind of content, I would appreciate it so much if you would subscribe or maybe leave a like on the video. But it's up to you. And let me know down in the comments if there are any skills you'd want to see me learn next. See ya.